One way I integrate technology is using the um, interactive whiteboard. Um, we use it for reading. It helps to keep the students um, on the same page. I've scanned in a lot of the pages, but it's also hands-on. The students um, go up to the board and they will drag words and put them in, fill in blanks. Um, they also have to do the writing. Um, I also use it in my uh, writing class where um, we can actually move sentences around. We can do the brainstorming. We'll do all the brainstorming and then we'll move it to another page and we'll write sentences for each one of our ideas. With the smart board and the note, uh, notebook software, they can actually, I can access a video, I can access uh, as an attachment um, a handbook that maybe goes over rules that I'm using in class. When I do the paragraph editing, um, Students will ask a question about a rule and I said, oh, let's take a look at it. For many people, they're glorified whiteboards or uh, um, trans uh, overhead projectors. But Susan, as always, is able to find the really exciting things that you can do with it. And so she makes it so that there's games. At one time, we were doing interactive things between our two sites. And my students could actually do things on her board. So I put on the, the uh, headset and so I was talking to her students and my students were completing a crossword going up and writing on the board. And to our amazement, her uh, students started writing on our smart board. She's a great motivating factor for our other instructors. And, and I've seen some of the things she's done in the classroom using smart boards. And most teachers will just use, still start out using smart board as something to lecture in front of. They may as well just have a sheet. Uh, then they see what she does and they are blown away and they see how progress the students are making and they just want to press it even further. I'm able to take uh, student essays and scan them and put them up on the board and you would think they would be afraid but they're not. They want to see their work up on the board and as a class we'll go through and offer suggestions to help them with their writing. We make a very comfortable environment for our students and so they're very willing to help each other and the smart board the students just watch for a few times and then as soon as they've watched they know they can do it and they're up there and they're writing on the board. When uh, a student's having difficulty with Play-Doh, we'll project Play-Doh up onto the board, but I can write on it and um, write on the, the actual web page and uh, um, work a problem out and then we'll close the ink layer and then put in the answer. And with the um, highlighter, I can outline, you know, I can show them, well, oh, it's right here, you know, and these are the rules about commas. And also with the United Streaming, I can also pull up a video. Hey, well, let's, let's watch a video on commas. And it's all right there together, packaged. Kind of fun to see the staff so enthused about it. We've, um, you know, Susan's a big part of that. Seeing what she does in the classroom, we've been, we've actually sent our adults with disabilities instructors, people working in facilities, um, to go to training in her classroom. And now they all want smart boards. So it's, she's probably gonna cost me money, but uh, it's good to have someone like her really driving this kind of change.